guys, what is going on and welcome back to What Shall We Do Next. I'm Mike, your host, and I hope you guys are having the best day ever. Before I get started guys, please subscribe if you are new here and you haven't already done that. We're on the road to 150,000 subscribers and I would love you to join me on this journey. So hit subscribe right now and join the fam. And also guys, go follow me on all my social media. Links are in the description. I have Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and even Snapchat. So go follow me on all of those. And guys, make sure you have your notification bell on. That way you get notified fight every time I upload a video. Thank you. But what is going on you guys and welcome back and today we are doing another Science Saturday even though it's Tuesday because well because it's not a Saturday thing. I just made that up. I don't even know why I originally said that. But anyway guys today we are doing another episode of what happens when and today we are going to find out what happens when you leave an egg in bleach for a whole month? Now, as you guys know, I put stuff in jars about a month ago. It's been a little over a month, actually, but I'm just going to put a month. It's so much simpler. Uh, but I have a jar right here with bleach in it and also an egg. Now, I did keep the egg in the shell because I had a theory that maybe the, egg, the bleach would somehow get into the egg and do something on the inside. I don't know. If it doesn't work, then uh, we can try it without the shell, maybe a hard boiled egg or something like that. Uh, we could do that next time, but I just wanted to test out this theory that maybe the bleach would be strong enough to do something to the egg, even through the shell. Maybe somehow it could like get through the shell and I don't know. It's, there's something interesting I want to point out to you guys, though. But first, we have to jump right over to it. So here you can see me putting in the egg. It's just in its shell, just a normal egg in the jar with bleach. This was over a month ago today. So I'm putting it in and uh, it's been sitting in this jar with bleach for over a month. So let's see what happened to it. Now here I am one month later with the jar. It's it's actually kind of dusty. Shows it's been sitting for a month and uh, the bleach has gotten a little funny color. I mean, it was kind of a yellowish color anyway because it was like uh, lemon flavored bleach and the egg pretty much looks the same, but there's something very interesting I'm gonna show you guys, maybe you guys on the little camera. Um, when we take it out of here and take a closer look this egg it's got like yellow cracks in it so I don't know what happened there nobody's touched this thing it's just been sitting so it's interesting to find out what's happened here okay so it's time to get leathered up not leather latex up can you guys in the little camera see okay give me a thumbs up if you can see me that means hit the like button <laughs> all right here we go guys Ooh, it's like a little ASMR video for you guys. Oh yeah. Oh, I bet that's giving you guys tingles, huh? Ooh, ow, friction burn. All right, guys, stop beating around the bush, Mike. Let's get this baby out of here. Okay, so, oh, let, let there be no explosion, God. Okay, here we are. Now, another thing I'm worried about is the smell. As you guys know, last time we did a steak and the smell was pretty nasty. So I got a feeling an egg could be worse. I'm not so sure. It smells off. It's It doesn't smell like egg. It just smells like something really weird. Um, it doesn't smell good though. It's definitely, there's the, the sweetness of the lemon flavored bleach. And I have my uh, tweezers, what are they called? Tongs. And I'm gonna take the egg out. We're gonna cut the egg open and see what's going on inside there. So I'm gonna move this over so you guys in the little camera can see. All right, come on out you. Okay, come on, come to, come to mama. Come to mommy. Okay, it's very uh, leaky. I'm not sure. There's a little bit of a weight issue here. 
Oh yeah, this is heavier than a regular egg. Now what I wanna show you guys on the little camera, sorry, take a look at this guys. I'm not sure, can I just see? Make sure you guys can see all right. Can you guys see that? There's yellow, <gasps> yellow cracks in the egg. It's very, uh, <gasps> it's hatching. <gasps> oh, there's going to be a very ugly creature come out of this now. Okay, so upon first glance, there doesn't seem to be, except for the yellowish cracks, and there is, there is some kind of off coloring. I don't know if you guys can see. There's like a, a brownish bruise type of shape right here. One there, one there, one there. And then we're covered with cracks here at the bottom. Okay, uh, we're gonna take the scalpel and try to cut this thing open. And uh, of course there's like the membrane inside. So I'm not so sure. I got a feeling this is gonna be a very messy job. So. Let's see what happens, guys. I'm going to try to be very careful and see what comes out of here. All right, I'm going to go, instead of destroying the egg, I'm going to try to... Oh, I'm peeling open the, the cracks. Oh, what is it? It's hatching. Oh, there's something nasty in there. Okay. One thing I have noticed is there's usually under the shell, there's usually like a membrane, like skin that seems to have gone. Um, now it's just like, it seems watery still. I was expecting it to be hard. Just take it out piece by piece. That's how you do it, Mike. Okay. There is a lot of nastiness in there. Get up. I dropped the piece. Oh, it's in. It's oh, it's sank. Oh, guys. I think there's like blood in here. Oh, I think we've created some kind of specimen, guys. This is some kind of alien is going to come out of here now. We're about to give birth to the alien. Oh, oh, it's getting everywhere. Oh, my God. Oh, God. Oh, hell no. Oh, this is going to be messy. Okay, can I saw my way into this? Oh, okay, the crack. I can pull this part off. Okay, there is still some membrane here, but it seems to have mostly gone. The yolk looks okay. Okay, how am I gonna do this? Should I pour it on the tray or pour it in the jar? Maybe we should pour it in the jar and see what happens. Okay. Can you guys see okay? All right, I'm gonna drop the egg. There does seem to be like red in there, but I think it might be the shell. I'm gonna drop the egg into the bleach and see what happens. Oh, oh, the yolk's stuck, guys. Uh-oh. Okay, make some space for the yolk. Oh, this is not working, guys. Oh, I should have thought about the size of the hole. Okay, there's the yolk. Oh, no. Oh, we lost the shell. Oh. Oh. Okay, well, here's inside the shell. I must have been, like, hallucinating, but there's no red in here. I was definitely seeing, like, a red. Okay, something's happening to the egg, guys. Oof. All right, let me try and figure out what to do here. <laughs> oh. oh, there's foam. I gotta get the shell. Get out of there, shell. I got ya. It's a dinosaur egg. Okay, now as you guys can see, there is, it's like the egg is dissolving. It's, it's becoming, 
There's the yoke right there. Why is the yoke not broke? <laughs> yoke not broke. There, I just rhymed. I'm a poet and I don't know it. All right, let's try and get that yoke back out because I got a feeling the yoke is kind of like solidified. Uh, there she, what in the hell? Guys, what have we done? What have we created? Are you guys seeing this? It's a bouncy ball. Okay, it doesn't quite bounce. Look what happened to the yoke, guys. The yoke became a hard ball. Okay, we have to take this open and see what's inside it. Is it really? Oh, 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 I squished it. Let's cut it open and see what's in there. Okay, it looks a little bit like some kind of sweet, some kind of candy. Yeah, like some kind of chewy, like Halloween candy. I don't know. Okay, well, that was kind of unusual. I wasn't expecting the yolk to be like a hard ball. Okay, so I guess that can go back in there. See what happens. And why not throw the shell in there too? Okay. Well, okay. I guess we know now what happens when you leave an egg in a shell in a jar full of bleach for a month. It becomes a bounce ball, guys. Who would have thought? But that is it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, smash the like button down below. Let's see if we can go for 100 likes on this video. I would really appreciate that. And my question to all of you guys for question of the day is what should we try next time? Um, over the next few days, I'm going to be doing things in bleach because I already put them in there a month ago. What should I do next time? Like, should I do Coke? Should I do vinegar? Should I do some kind of like, should I do some kind of... Uh, other chemical type substance like bleach. I don't know. You guys let me know in the comment section. That is question of the day. But thank you all for watching. I love you all. And remember the most important thing, chase your dreams. And I'll see you guys next time.